Hello friends, welcome to Top Capable Channel. It's not uncommon to forget your iPhone passcode and find yourself locked out of your device. Some of you guys may want to bypass the iPhone passcode and regain management of your device. So in today's video, here are some of the best and most effective ways that can help you easily bypass the password of your iPhone. Erase iPhone feature which was released on iOS 15.2 and later iOS devices allow you to bypass the lock screen with a few simple clicks. On the iPhone you need to bypass the passcode, keep entering the wrong passcode several times, your iPhone will be displayed iPhone unavailable, when the waiting time reaches 15 minutes, you will get an erase iPhone option on the bottom right corner of the screen. When you see this option, simply hit on it. Next, an erase all contents and settings page will appear to let you know that if you confirm to bypass the iPhone passcode, all your data on your device will be gone at the same time. If you don't really want to lose your information and files, it still allows you to try the passcode again 15 minutes later. So on this page, tap erase iPhone again is a good alternative for you. Afterward, Enter your Apple ID password to sign out of your original Apple account. After a short while, you will be able to see the progress of the erase on your iPhone, and it will automatically restart as the erasing process ends. If the erase iPhone option is not given, let's try this equally effective solution, use Find My App. You will need to prepare another iOS device beforehand. Don't worry if you don't have a spare iPhone or iPad you can skip this method and try the next one by computer. In another device, simply tap on the Find My icon on the home screen and open it up. If you don't have this app installed, go to Apple Store to download one. Type in the login account and password to the prompts, tap Devices from the menu bar at the bottom, slide up and you will see all the devices which share the same Apple ID. If there are several devices on the list, you need to confirm which one is the unavailable one and tap it. Swipe up again on this page and reconfirm the unavailable iPhone. If there is no problem, tap erase this device option right here. Tap continue to certify you've already known that all the data will be erased when the phone connects to the internet. Tap erase for the last time, then it will ask for the Apple ID password to trigger off the erasure. As you can see, your iPhone is loading which signals it is being erased. This process will take about 2 minutes, once finished, you won't see the unavailable message anymore. If the erase iPhone can't be funded on the screen, that's because some models have this feature while others don't. Don't be afraid. Your iPhone still can be rescued by using recovery mode. Recovery mode allows you to bypass the iPhone passcode via restoring iPhone and giving you access to configure your iPhone again. Before using this method, here are some requirements you need to check out. 1. Make sure you have the latest version of iTunes installed on your computer. 2. Prepare a compatible USB cable. Now, let's check the steps on how to enter recovery mode together. If you have an iPhone 8 or newer model, turn off your iPhone by dragging the power off slider at first, once it turns off automatically, keep pressing and holding the side button while immediately connecting your iPhone to the computer. When you see a cable pointing to the computer, let go of the button. E button. If you have an iPhone 7 or iPhone 7 Plus, turn off your iPhone at first. Then. Keep pressing and holding the volume down button while immediately connecting your iPhone to the computer. When the recovery mode screen appears, release your finger. If you have an iPhone 6S or older model, turn off your device. Then keep pressing and holding the home button while immediately connecting your iPhone to the computer. Let go of the button until you see the recovery mode screen. Once your iPhone is in recovery mode, Open iTunes app on your computer and it will show, there is a problem with the iPhone that requires it to be updated or restored, click restore option, then click restore and update on the next pop-up window. After that, iTunes will start downloading the software for your iPhone, 
it will restore your iPhone when the download process completes. The download time will vary from 15 minutes to 2 hours, it's depending on your internet speed and download source. You can click this download icon in the top right corner to check the download progress. If the time takes more than 15 minutes, your device will exit recovery mode screen. If you want to try this method again, you need to start all over again. Once downloaded, the above middle bar on the computer screen will show the process of the iOS installation, which means that iTunes is preparing to restore the software on this iPhone. Your iPhone will show the restoration progress with an Apple logo and loading bat, it will take a few minutes. After your iPhone restarts, you can reset your iPhone from scratch. If the two above methods don't work for you, you also can bypass your iPhone passcode with a third-party tool called iPhone Unlocker. It can help you bypass iPhone passcode in just a few simple clicks. You can get this tool from AppGeeker's official website, the link is also put below this video. In today's video, we share with you three method to reset your locked iPhone. Undoubtedly, it can become easier with iPhone Unlocker, choose one you prefer. Hopefully this tutorial can help you, if it does, give us a thumb up and subscribe to us, see you next time.